my dear students how are you all i hope you all are fine and doing practice at home isn't it yes great job kids we have already covered few topics such as shapes around us straight lines and curved lines and different types of shapes in which we have learned how to draw straight lines and curved lines and different shapes yes now it's time to move ahead with our new topic that is patterns so let's begin with it hello students welcome to the session 3 of chapter 5 shapes and patterns our last topic of this chapter is patterns so let us understand first what is pattern patterns are created when figures shapes objects etc are arranged in a particular order and repeated over and over again kids let's understand this more clearly by an example kids let's make one rangoli here by using different basic shapes which you have learned yes so let's start kids can you please tell me which shape is this yes think think very nice it's square yes now identify which shape is this yes this is triangle now we are going to put this triangle at each and every corner so let's start yes now let's move ahead which shape is this yes very nice this is circle this is rectangle in the same way in opposite direction you have to make another rectangle yes in this way we have completed here our rangoli very nice kids have you observed one thing over here yes we have used different basic shapes over here yes and when we are going to arrange all these shapes in particular order and repeat over and over again then this is known as a pattern very good it is so easy to understand isn't it yes kids i want all of you to do homework yes in homework you all have to make one rangoli of your choice by using different basic shapes okay so now let's proceed further observe the following patterns kids can you see here a few patterns yes yes you all can see that there are few shapes so let's start here our first shape is square square then triangle again square triangle again square then triangle yes you can see a series of shapes over here same way it follows yes so again we have to draw which shape we are going to draw yes after triangle that is square very nice in this way pattern follows very good now let's see another one yes rectangle circle rectangle circle rectangle circle then very good again rectangle and circle very good now can you see here rectangle yes but rectangle is in two ways one in horizontal way and one in vertical way yes the first one is in vertical then horizontal vertical horizontal vertical horizontal yes if i ask you which one will be the next one yes vertical very good kids you all have to observe these patterns and you have to see which one will be the next one very good now let's proceed further kids in a class on the floor decks are arranged in a particular order yes and they are repeated again and again yes can you see yes so this is called a pattern this is what patterns is yes now let's understand it by an example yes kids here are few images of tiles yes 
you all have seen that the floor is made of tiles. Yes, and tiles have their different designs. Yes, what we have to do here, we have to make one pattern. So let's start. See, one, like this, two, three, and four. Kids, when four different tiles we arrange all together, then you can see one pattern over here. Yes, each and every tiles have designs. This is what pattern. Yes. So let's proceed further. Color and continue the patterns. Yes. Now you have to continue this pattern by seeing different colors. So first one that is yellow, red, yellow, red. And after red, which? Yes, very nice. Yellow, then again red. Very good. Then blue, brown, blue, brown, then blue and brown. Very nice. Now, which shape is this? Yes, this is circle. Yes. Now, can you please identify which color is this? Yes, purple, blue, purple, blue. So, after blue, which color is going to be the next one? Yes, that is purple. Very nice. I think you all understood very nicely. So, now let's proceed further. Draw and continue the patterns. Kids, you all can see here big triangle, then small triangle, big triangle, then small triangle. So, after small triangle, which we are going to draw here? Yes, right. That is big triangle. Now next one. That is a rectangle, circle, rectangle, circle. Which one is going to be the next one? Yes, after circle. Very good. That is rectangle. Great job. Now third one. That is a square, then rectangle. Square, rectangle, square. Now which shape you are going to draw next? Yes. After square, which one? Think, think. Very nice. Correct. That is rectangle. Kids, it's really easy to understand, isn't it? Yes. Now, let's move ahead. Kids, till now, we have learned different basic shapes. And we have also learned how to draw. Isn't it? Yes. Great job done by you all. Very nice. Now we are going to solve few questions over here. Yes, that are related to the shapes. So let's start. First one, take the thing that is circle in shape. Yes, here are few images of the things are given. You have to relate that shape and that image together. Yes, first one is wheel, carom board and clown cap. So now kids, you all have to observe here and find out which thing is similar to circle shape. Yes, very nice. Wheel is similar to circle. So let's take. Now second one, take the thing that is rectangle in shape. First one that is a slice of a pizza, tiffin box and television that is TV. Yes, now, you have to take the thing that is similar to rectangle shape. First one, pizza slice. It is triangle in shape. Tiffin box, that is square in shape. And television, that is rectangle. Very nice. So, this is our correct answer. Now, third one, take the thing that is triangle in shape. Now, you have to observe here and you have to take the thing that is similar to triangle shape. Mobile phone, no, it is rectangle in shape. Plate, it is circular in shape. This is a wall clock. Yes, it looks similar to triangle. Yes, so this is our correct answer. So let's take it. Yes, kids, I want all of you to draw different basic shapes at home and practice more. So till then, bye and thank you.